When we broke up, you said you wanted to stay friends. Your words, not mine. However, you seem to have a funny definition of the word friend. What type of friend tries this hard to avoid contact? As you don't seem to care about anything I have to say, I thought you wouldn't mind me posting this video message. Maybe we can read the comments on your Facebook and see what your other friends think. The front for my book. She's part of the popular demographic. You put someone else's name on my book. No one is going to read a book written by a graduate. What life experience do you have? That doesn't matter. It's my book. My stories, my ideas, my characters, it's mine. All mine. I own it. In 2010, when you signed to us, you gave us full artistic and creative licensing. Yes? Are you telling me you're stealing my book and pocketing the money from it? The fact that you have a cheque alone is proof enough that we know what we're doing. You vile bastard. How dare you sit there and tell me this theft is justified. I will see you in court for this. You think I need you? I don't need you. I was writing long before I met you and I'll be writing long after you're gone. I don't even like gingers. Well then why are you dating Toby? I wanted something exotic, but not dangerous. Not a Mediterranean or anything extreme like a black guy. Something more timid, damp and controllable. Anyone from Wells really. Maybe it's her necklace. <laughs> Maybe it's the hair, do you like it? I had mine done to match her profile pic. This outfit as well as hers. That's right, hers. It's not something similar. It's not something similar I picked up at Topshop. It's her outfit, just like the necklace.